Well, lucky here. It's another mission with Bonnie. We're gonna try and get as many, um, any, oh, as, as many Marston, of the main missions you? done. Good, Mr. McFarlane. How are you? I'm well. Would you mind riding with me to Armadillo? I've got to get some supplies and I could do with the company. Of course. You can take the reins. It wouldn't do for a terrifying bounty hunter such as yourself to be seen driven around by a woman. <laughs> Hop on up, Mr. Marston. Wagon, huh? No driver's seat, right. <laughs> Convenient that, that I'm going to Armadillo as well. You're looking much better, considering you were almost buzzard food a couple days ago. I have you to thank for that, miss. So do tell me, have you needlessly risked your life since we last spoke? No, miss, I have not. Well, that's a relief. Perhaps there's hope for you yet. I wouldn't bet on it. Oh, there's always hope, Mr. Marston. You can't be a rancher in this kind of country if you don't believe that. An admirable attitude, miss. I suppose so. I can't think of any other way to stay sane, to be frank. What about you? Have you ever given up hope altogether? Hope hasn't really entered into it. It's not really something I think about. A peculiar outlook. I can't really say I understand you. I can't always say I do either. Oh, don't be so deliberately enigmatic. I'm not, miss. Yes, you are. You are being deliberately obscure as a substitute for having a personality. I just know there are two theories to arguing with women, and neither one works. I'm not even going to dignify that gibberish with a response. One of these, these, uh, these cowboys, this cowboy and this, uh, this lady talking about dignified response. I think it's kind of funny response. I found you dying on the side of the road and now you're driving me into town. You have a strange sense of humor. Well, you must admit, it's an unusual start to a friendship. I didn't realize we were friends, Mr. McFarland. Oh, please. Way. Now who's being funny? Listen. I know that business with Williamson is your business, but I don't know. You've been good to us, and I don't think you're a bad man. A little stupid, perhaps, but not rotten. I just worry about you gallivanting around these parts like you're some kind of deranged bounty hunter. Like Paul always says, don't go waking snakes. I appreciate your concern for us lesser mortals, Miss McFarland. I really do. And if there was any other way out, I'd take it. I can assure you of that. Hey, we're in town. Go horse. You never did tell me where you live. I have a small holding up in Great Plains. A farmer? Yeah, and I'm the Queen of England. And at what point during your day of hunting down outlaws do you find time to raise chickens? Only been at it three years or so. I guess I'm kind of new to it. We're here. So this Mid is City. Armadillo. Manhattan it is not, but it does okay for us. Most important thing for you right now is getting yourself into Dr. Johnson's office to purchase some medicine. The first one's on me. Thank you, miss. I'll pay you back. I'm sure you shall. The doc's a good fellow. He saved your life, so be polite to him. Meet me in front of the general store when you're done. You see, if I were living in 1911 and I found a stranger outside with a gunshot wound, I would not save him. Let's just put it that way. I'm distrusting like that. Talk to the doctor to purchase some medicine. I'm feeling ill, I hope. Need some luck. Howdy, friend. Thank you kindly. Need to lose weight. Did you say you need to lose weight? And that liver. Press select to open up my satchel. Medicine. Hooray. General store. Hello, Bonnie. Well, thanks for driving me. It was nice to be able to enjoy the view for once. And a little company never hurts now and again. You're more than welcome, miss. Least I can do. Thank you for the medicine. Why don't you have a look around Armadillo? You can always take a stagecoach back to the ranch later. I might just do that. Travel safely, miss. Try not to get yourself shot. I won't be around to save you this time. Possible to recover, man. 
I'll do my best to not get killed, I guess. N no promises though, if you want to leave Armadillo, there's usually stagecoach loading and unloading behind the freight station. Okay. They cost money though, don't they? Oh my. It's a gunsmith. Hang on. I haven't gotten any money, so... Marshall it is. It's Marshall's here, huh? Tumbleweed. How very Western. Political re realities in Armadillo. Huh. Well. Excuse me. Hey. Hey. You got a visitor. <coughs> Shut up, you! Now, what you want? My name's John Marston. You wanted to speak to me. I did? Apparently so. Why? I guess because we're both in the business of the law. You that fella from the train company? No, I'm from Fort Mercer. Fort Mercer? You them, one of them Williamson boys. Calm down. Go on, shoot him, mister. Shoot him. <laughs> Come what, you, you getting cute with me, boy? What's going on here? I got me one of them Williamson boys. I got me one of them idiots who give marshals a bad name. Oh, no. Put your gun down. You must be the man from Blackwater. Yes, sir. Listen, that dog ain't too bright. But he seems loyal. Jonah, get out of here for a minute. Yes, sir, Mr. Johnson, sir. And you. Oh, I done seen enough of your hide around here, friend. <laughs> I think there's some school children down the way you can go and frighten. Oh, hardy fucking whore. <laughs> what are you doing here, Mr. Marston? Apart from frightening my deputies. I'm here to capture or kill Bill Williamson. <laughs> okay. Can you help me? He's outside my jurisdiction. He's in the next county. Of course, Bill Williamson and his boys have tended to keep themselves away from my town. So you're happy to have him out there? Well, I ain't happy, but I also ain't suicidal. My job is to keep this town safe, not clean up all of these three counties. It's hard enough around here. You know, I hear you speak, and suddenly I'm reminded of how some of the people I respected most in my life had a problem with authority. What's wrong with you? Well, I'm sure you and your fine friends have enjoyed spending your time running around pursuing noble causes. My cause is to keep this town from turning into a living hell for the folks who live here. The whole world has problems, mister. And I'm here doing what I can. Why? What's happening? Right now? I got the railway, the people who pay my salary, trying to get me to turn a blind eye to them burning down settlements up there. I got a bunch of cattle rustlers out near Box Canyon need shutting down. Not forgetting the gang that keeps murdering homesteaders out in the back country. And I got a bunch of hoods over in the saloon, drunk, threatening to shoot up the whole town. That's all I got today. But it's early yet. Give me a couple more days. There'll be more. All right. Tell you what. <sighs> Let's go deal with them hoods in the saloon. Then we'll discuss Williamson. Okay, boy. You're a persistent little cuss, ain't you? Only when things matter. That guy being locked Come up on is then, hilarious. Marston. Follow me. Company Marshal Johnson to the saloon. Oh, he's not gonna run, is he? Well. So who are we looking for? A bunch of two-bit hoodlums. 
led by this fella called Walt. Goddamn road agents who prey on the stages coming in and out of town. Drivers and armadillos spend more time with their hands in the air than on the reins these days. And you're happy to let them drink in your saloon? Happy? No. But the way I figure it, better they're carousing in there than out robbing decent folk. Sure, if you see if you want it that way. There's the dumb rat bastard now. Let's follow him. See what kind of hole he crawls into. Sure, we need a horse. Walton's the top screw. Let's get after him. Damn, he's seen us. Come on, don't lose him. as bad as you say he is, why don't we just beef him now while we got the chance? Because that ain't how the law works. Is that right, Marshal? And alive, he can still talk. Doesn't sound like he's a man to be reasoned with. He ain't. But a few days of my hospitality and he'll be telling me what I need to know. Walm's gang's been growing fast. That lawn's easy money for easy work. Chola Springs, Gap Tooth Ridge, these boys get around. Walm's a start, but there's plenty more where he came from. Pretty sure all these guys are going to just oh fuck you. Stop going going my way. Pretty sure all these guys are just going to like shoot us on sight and not actually reason with us. They're out boss. Come on! Oh good sir. Hold up, Marston. He must be at the old Pleasant's house. Probably best we take it on foot from here. On foot? Are you kidding? Come on, Damn. starting to shoot. Take cover. We'll work our way up this hill. Hey, yeah, you, over here. Move up to that wagon on your right. I'll cover you. Arson, take that bastard behind the train. Oh. Elmos, I see tougher schoolgirl. Get to that crate. I got you covered. Watch out for that bastard behind the rock. I put a window in your skull, Walton. You brought help, didn't you? Well, I'm gonna kill both of you dumb bastards. All right, here we go. Pistol time. Pull back. I took that out. Come on now! Stop that! You're a hard man, are you? Now get to that rock. I'll shoot you through the face. I'm a badass. Look out! There's one behind the outhouse! Oh. Take cover behind the outhouse! Careful, there may be more of them! Up here, cocksuckers! <laughs> you ain't that tough, Walton! Oh my good god! Guess Walton left now! Try to take him alive! How do I do that? Have to walk either shoot him in the legs or his foot. He's both! Try to take him alive! Leg shot! Walton, your killing days are over. It'll be trial and the rope for you. Yeah, got him alive. Not a bad shot, Mr. Marston. Why don't you check in with me next time you're in town? I don't want to be no policeman, Marshal. <laughs> Nor did I, my friend. I can promise you that. I'll see you soon, Mr. Marston. Yeah, you too, yeah. Marshal. Oh, there. Fuck. Wait, now what am I gonna do here? Money? Oh my god, I can pay back Bonnie. Now, what are you hiding in your little house, Walton? Chest. Can I open the container? Yeah. Fuck yeah, there's money. 
Molten gang member menu. Outfit. Right. Loot body. Repeat it. Yeah. Alright. Uh, let's see. These are just bodies I can loot. Come on. Give me shit. Let's have a look at what goes for uh, honorable and what doesn't. Notes. Uh, outfit? Stats? Option? No. Stats? General. Crimes? Travel, money, combat, store, school. Fine, whatever. The marshal left you a long way. You can quick travel back to town by using the destination feature of your camp. Open satchel and choose camp. I see. Hang on a sec. So I gave. You can search. Yeah, nice. That's what I'm doing. Bunch of fighting going on. Where is the gunfire coming from? Give me all your shit. Oh well. Okay. Select. Warhorse. No, that's not what I wanted, is it? Is that is that a DLC? No, a uh, kit, basic campsite. There you go. What? Yay! You now own a new horse. You're coming with an Apiary Campbell Ranch. Nice. Travel to destination. Let's go back to um. Let's go back to Armadillo. Let's go help the marshal again. Step on it. Step on it. So I so that little pamphlet thing gives me a, a new horse. That's cool. I want to whistle for my horse and see what he looks like. Come on, there you go. Horsey, it's like Roach. Where the hell are you? There you are, buddy boy. What a badass. Alright, let's go help the marshal again, shall we? Poker. Yeah, I'm not great at poker. Even in real life. Hola. Huh. Strangers are found throughout the world. Oh god, there's a... There's a, there's a skull and crossbones there. You know what? Let's go to it. Let's go to that instead. Marshall, you can wait. What is that? Oh, it's a wanted poster. Holds of you. Mon Van Bar. Yeah, let's let's hunt Mon Van Bar. Bounty target was last seen near. Hello, sir. Get on in. All right, come on, horse. Let's go hunting. Yeah. Chicken head guy. No, we're going hunting. Oh my god, don't tell me he's like super far away. Let's go. Come on. Can I open a map? Map. Okay. Oh, it's not that far away. Uh, waypoint. Get back on the main road because I have to go up. Come on! Eh. 
cannon gun state. Step. 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 Let's go. Chill out, horse. Stop nade. Hello. Look how nice this is. Drifting horse. Now, near the bounty target's last known location. Go. Yeah. I'll see him. These are all optional, I guess. Come on, easy up there. So shoot him in the legs to Come disable on. him. Come on. Kill the bounty target. You gotta kill him. God. Wow. Sorry okay, so partner. I can't. I couldn't hog tie him because of something. Take the bounty proof to McFarland Ranch's jail. I wish someone taught me how to like take, take targets alive. Sheriff. Apple. Away. Come here. Oh my god, okay. Horse. You're leaving, you're leaving. High ground. All right. Let's put a marker here. Check him out. Go down. Oh, we can't go down. Oh, relax, boss. I will kill you like, like I did Skyrim, boss. There you are. Buddy boy. Stop trying to shoot. Jump off. Good lord, this music's going forever. We'll take it from here. Here's your payment. 
shove that money in your, t in your shorts. Alrighty. Let's see if we can pay Bonnie back. Come back between 5am and 6pm. The guy is like a GTA style game. Oh well. Let's go back home I guess. Take a sleep. And we'll wake up. I'm not gonna help with your patrols. Do it yourself. Jorge. Alright. Uh, save game. Good night, y'all.